Namaste, Sitaram. A pleasant good morning. Welcome to Rudraya. I am your host, Nisha Sharma, and Rudraya is being brought to you with the kind compliments of Maha Rudrativ Mandir. And of course, our Mandir is located at 850 Tapscott Road, Unit 34 in Scarborough, with Tapscott and McNichol being our closest intersection. So, of course, this is our last Saturday for the month of November. And, um, you know, the, the year is quickly coming to an end. And of course, we are about to be making plans to end this year, but also making plans for the new year. So with that, we'll join our spiritual leader, Pandit Ravi Sharma, for our Pravachan. Enjoy. <laughs> Receive the fruits of our good fortune of all our past lives that we've been wandering here, there, and everywhere. And it is only through the grace of the Gurus who have come in our life that we're able to see and to understand.
the guru itself is the one who comes and removes. The guru is called as the one who has already walked the pathway. And so they are able now to tell us that we should not follow such pathway. And gurus like Panadeswan Sharma and others like him of this caliber, it is rare to find such gurus. It is said that we don't have to go searching here, there, and everywhere, but a guru itself is one who will come in our life. Devotees suffice to say. This afternoon, I thought I would share with you some of the essential teachings uh, as taken from our Shastra. Now, when I say Shastra, it is a culmination itself of various texts, not just one text. As we were indicating that the uh, glories of the Lord, Asita Giri Samansat Kajalam Sindhu Patrai Surataru Varshaka Likati Yari Grihitva, that God's glory indeed is so vast. That in fact, one had asked the question that can you count the glories of the Lord? Then there is asking that are you able to count every drop of the ocean, every drop of water? Are you able to count every grain of sand that is there on the seashore? You will see an impossible task. Such indeed is called as the glories of God. It cannot be contained. It is called as neti, neti, which means it is not this. It is not this. It means it is much, much more. So devotees and life. Devotees and life, it is indicated that there are going to be winning days in our life. There are going to be good days. And there are going to be not so good days. But the wise have indicated that one will embrace and they will see the challenges of the not so good days and they will face it. So also, one will learn the lessons that is there also. So when we lose sometime in life, do not lose the lesson. In Bhagavad Gita, it tells us in this most beautiful verse, Om Jairadhi Krishna Hare Jairadhi Krishna Hare Om Jairadhi Krishna Hare Jairadhi Krishna Atma, Atmanam, Na Atman, Vasa, Adayeta, Atma Eva, Ya Atmano, Bandur At Eva, Ripur Atmanaha. It is said in Bhagavad Gita, chapter 6, verse 5. It tells us that indeed, that you have the power to elevate yourself. The mana or the mind itself has been given to you. And so you have the power itself to elevate yourself. And you also have this very same power to degrade yourself. For the mind can be called as one's best friend. Or the mind can also be called as the enemy 
of the self. The mind can elevate you, the mind can become your best friend, or the mind can also be your worst enemy. Devotees, we are all responsible for our own elevation, our own debasement in life. The gurus will come and they will all show us and point us towards the pathway. But ultimately, it becomes your choice in life. Devotees, it is indicated that none can traverse the pathway of God realization for us. If one can simply come and say that, do not worry and do not despair, I will take all your sins. I will do everything for you. Devotees, is it possible? It is impossible. Devotees, in the same manner, none can traverse the pathway of God realization for us. But we have to make the choice. The Guru is the saint. They will show us the pathway, is what our scriptures indicate. But we all have to traverse it ourselves. This is a beautiful Doha that tells us. presents Utsav Ki Iksham, an evening of celebration, on December 11, 2022, from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. Doors open at 2.30 p.m., featuring two of the most popular singers for 2022, Mawa, Parial, and Jay Solanki. Tickets are only $50 and dinner is included. Tickets are limited for this live event because the event is going to be held at Maha Ruchadit Mandir. So please be sure to secure your tickets early. Would like to acknowledge our sponsors for this event and we hope to see you there for this grand celebration of 2022. My dear viewers, I hope you've enjoyed this morning's Pravachan. And of course, last week, I am sure that you saw our program that we're planning for December 11th right here at the temple. Uh, we're trying to uh, schedule the program at 3 p.m. a little bit earlier. As we know that uh, winter, it gets, you know, it starts getting dark at 5. So it's going to be at 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. Utsav Ki Sham. It's an evening of celebration. So please, tickets are limited. If you'd like to join us, please be sure to book your tickets by today because uh, seating is limited at the Mandir. And of course, throughout the program today, you're going to see be, you're going to be seeing clips of those two amazing singers that we will be featuring on December 11th. I hope you enjoy this next item. You know, there is a famous dialogue in this movie. I love you, Kiran. <laughs> जादू तेरी नजर खुशबू तेरा बदन जादू तेरी नजर खुशबू तेरा बदन रोहा कर या ना कर रोहा कर या ना कर तू है मे जादू तेरी नजर खुशबू 
तेरा बदन जादू तेरी नजर खुशबू तेरा बदन तू हाँ कर या ना कर तू हाँ कर या ना कर तू है मेरी किरण तू है मेरी किरण खबर मेरी तक दीर है तू मेरे खाब की तस्वीर है तू बेखबर मेरी तक दीर है तू तू किसी और की हो न जाना कुछ भी कर जाऊंगा मैं दीवाना तू आते तू है मेरी किरण तू है मेरी किरण On December 11, 2022, from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m., doors open at 2:30 p.m., featuring two of the most popular singers for 2022, Mawa Parial and Jay Solanki. Tickets are only $50, and dinner is included. Tickets are limited for this live event because the event is going to be held at Maha Rujadit Mandir. So please be sure to secure your tickets early. Would like to acknowledge our sponsors for this event, and we hope to see you there for this grand celebration of 2022. My dear viewers, I hope you are enjoying this morning's program. And of course, like I mentioned to you, uh, Jay Solanki and Mawa uh, Parial, two of the most popular singers for 2022. And for those of you who attended our program last year. It was a non-stop singing of your favorite Bollywood songs from yesteryears, and of course the modern songs for the youths. So please be sure to call us and reserve your seating. We'll now join Kamal Ji from Lotus Funeral Home for our corporate segment. The Sitaram and Namaste. My name is Kamal Bardwaj, and I'm the owner of Lotus Funeral and Cremation Center in Toronto, and Kitchener Funeral Homes and Crematorium in Kitchener. I'm also a licensed funeral director. Today, I'm going to speak about driving in a procession to a cemetery for a burial. Usually, the procession is driving much slower compared to the posted speed limit. 
When you drive, stay close to the car in front of you. The procession will eliminate the possibility of vehicles to cut into the procession. Stay in line with the procession at all times. Please obey all traffic driving regulations, in particular to stop at traffic lights. Unless there are police escorts, all drivers are required to follow traffic light rules. Each vehicle will be tagged with a funeral card indicating to other drivers on the road that your car is part of a funeral procession. At the cemetery property, once a vehicle is parked on the road, one of the funeral staff will remove the funeral cards from your car. So please do not lock it into your car. Please ensure when driving a procession that you put on your four-way flashers. The procession is typically led by the lead car or the funeral home hearse. For other drivers on the road that are not part of the funeral procession, always be respectful to the procession cars. Don't cut in between the procession cars and don't honk at the driving procession. At Lotus Funeral and Cremation Center and at Kitchener from Funeral Homes and Crematorium, we operate seven days a week, 24 hours a day. Our crematorium is located in our building so we never have to leave our building in cold or bad weather for cremation. Our crematorium space can have large groups of people to attend a witnessing of the cremation as well. For Hindu families, we provide all the puja items including fresh leaves and a haven kund. We have large halls that can accommodate 500 seating to smaller ones. We are centrally located for families in the west and for families in the east. For more information, please contact me from the telephone number on your screen. Thank you for watching and see you next week on Rudraya. Sitaram. Maharudrit Mandir presents Utsav Ki Iksham, an evening of celebration on December 11, 2022, from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. Doors open at 2.30 p.m. Featuring two of the most popular singers for 2022, Mawa, Parial, and Jay Solanki. Tickets are only $50 and dinner is included. Tickets are limited for this live event because the event is going to be held at Maha Rujadit Mandir. So please be sure to secure your tickets early. Would like to acknowledge our sponsors for this event and we hope to see you there for this grand celebration of 2022. Mata Saraswati. Lakshmi Mata Saraswati. Devotees all forms as Mata Lakshmi, as Mata Saraswati. They all come from the form of this Chandika Devi. My dear viewers, I hope you've enjoyed today's program. Would like to send uh, special birthday greetings to our Goa daughter, Crystal Gopal, as she celebrated her birthday this past week. So, Crystal, on behalf of Pandit Ravi, myself, Maharajit Mandir, and of course the crew at Rudraya, we want to wish you a happy, happy birthday, and may Lord Shiva shower you with his choicest blessings. Would like to thank our kind sponsors at Maha Rujadip Mandir as well as our executive producer Gari Khan for making Rudraya possible. And of course, please do remember that if you are interested in joining us on December 11th for our celebration of, of life as well, um, for this year, 2022, we made it through. So we're having this event to commemorate um, our hardships, but to celebrate our life as well. Please be sure to reserve your seating with us because the event is going to be held at Maharajadev Mandir and of course seating is limited. So we hope to see you on December 11th and um, of course we'd like to thank our kind sponsors at Maharajadev Mandir as well as our executive producer Gari Khan for making Rujaya possible. And so until we meet again next week, have a blessed week. Namaste. <laughs> Happy birthday to you Go another great year for you Go Happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you Bad bad is in the year It's your birthday so let me party
let's gather to cut the cake Cheers to your life, let's celebrate Happy birthday Go. to you Go. Another great year Go. for you Go. Happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you Got a rum and stop the clap Clap, clap your hands and 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 clap Clap, clap We pray for health, strength and positivity All the blessings for you We hope for long life and prosperity all the blessings to you We wish you greatness in everything you do All God's blessings to you There is no one, no one like you We love you Body, body, in the air It's your birthday, so let me party Let's gather to cut the cake Cheers to your life, let's Happy birthday Go. to you Go. Another great year Go. for you Go. Happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you Got a rum and stop the clap Clap, clap your hands and 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 clap Clap, clap for success and stability All the blessings to you We hope you enjoy this festivity Yeah, yeah, yeah. 